Hi, I'm Li Fan and I'm from Beijing. This is my Russian trip diary. When I was packing up for the trip, I thought, oh my god, I don't even know anyone in Russia. What am I gonna do there all along? But I met these girls and everything just became so easy. They showed me the city, it was my first day in Moscow, but I feel like I was loco. We had a really great time together. Next day, I had a flight to Sochi. He's only take two hour flight from Moscow and... BOOM! You are in the mountains! It's kind of easy to make new friends on the slope, but meeting Olympic couple? Come on! Alena and Vic? Wow, still can't believe this. In Russia at some point, you just find yourself in the middle of nowhere. I was so lucky to meet those guys who gave me a ride. And they were on a road trip for about a month or so. I never really meant to go this far. But they showed me their plan and I was like, why not? It looks fun. Let's do it. So early in the morning, we went up the road. It took the whole day to find the place where you can catch the most beautiful sunset in Altai Mountains. Wow, that was pretty much the best moment of this journey. Then I made this amazing trip to meet some of native people of Far East Russia. And I'm really proud of myself because I spent almost all day on a horse. When I finally made it to the village, I was really touched with all that music and dancing and people. It was a lifetime experience. Finally, when I saw the ocean, I was... Wow, it was worth it, all those days on the road. And winter surfing? Oh my god. Could I even imagine that two weeks ago? I don't think so. But those guys, they just made me want to try it. Looking back, I can say my journey was all about the people. And my memories of Russia is like a map full of names. Names of my new friends and people I've met.